Hello everybody, back here on uh, GameCube. I know we've been here several times, but... Yeah. So, this is a game I wanted, I was planning on doing, but then I decided I don't feel like playing this. But then I was like... You know what? I'm gonna go through it. I'm gonna go through the pain. I'm gonna try to complete as much of this game as I possibly can. And that game... Is Batman Dark Tomorrow. You know how bad this game is. It's one of the worst games ever. It's probably the worst Batman game ever. Most people don't know about this game. It's because, you know, the Arkham series made people like, Oh, those are the Batman games. And they forgot that this game even existed. So, for those who wanted to forget this game existed, well, I'm sorry. I hate to dig up some repressed memories, but here you go. Yeah, I can't see anything. Sorry for that glare. By the way, it's daytime, so, you know, you gotta deal with that. So let's just put this in and play it. Oh. Look at that memory card. So many of these I want to play again, and there's some- oh, there's true card. Some of these I haven't played yet. I really want to, but I don't know when. It's like this, 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 this. I don't know about this. I'm kind of worried about Nintendo and their copyright system. <laughs> but like all these I've played on the channel before. Everything down here I played, but I'd like to play it again because that was like when I was like new or starting out. I'm a bit more experienced. So. It'd be interesting to play those again. And I think with this game, it's been... I played this over a year ago. Which I find kind of funny. Chemco! They're awful. They're an awful company. And I can't believe DC actually put their name on this. I don't understand. I know it's Batman, but I would not want my name on this at all. I'm trying to be all stylish. Need to go to options. Dude, we gotta get this brightness up because it's so bad. Alright. The reason why I turn up the brightness is because when I try I filmed this before, it was like nighttime. And it still looked terrible. It looked so bad. It was so dark. You couldn't see anything. And there wasn't even a glare on the TV. And if you still can't see the game with no glare on TV, that's bad. That's just bad. So I gotta bring up the brightness like to its highest level in order for you to see it. Now, in this game, this opening cutscene, it's obviously outsourced because none of the game the rest of the game looks nowhere near as good as this, but this is easily the best part of the game, by far. Because one, you're not playing it, and two, it actually looks decent for the time. Can we stop playing the pronoun game, please? I know Batman's supposed to be like a dark series, but it doesn't have to be like this dark, literally. You can barely see anything. Yes, my lord. But that's Raj Al Ghul, if you didn't know that. This whole thing just kind of makes me a question. Why would anyone live in Gotham? It seems like a very bad place to live. With all these criminals running around like Joker and Penguin and, you know, Catwoman and uh, Harley. Is Harley in this game? I don't think she is. Yeah, there's like Killer Croc and whatnot. Like, uh, like, why? Oh boy, we're getting that flashback again. The flashback we've seen like how many times? A thousand? A thousand one? 
We know what happens. We're not stupid. <laughs> okay, maybe the graphics aren't so good. I mean, this was 2003, so I'm not gonna be that harsh. And there's the pearls. Remember, that was like a broke uh, visual shot they used in uh, Batman v Superman when they showed the death scene. That was the best part of that movie. That scene alone made me think, Batman v Superman is a way over a hype. There's no way it's as bad as people say it. And I saw the rest of the movie and I was just like, oh, I see. So I'm looking at the back of this, uh, you know, game case. Real twisted secrets of Gotham City as you fight Batman's deadly foes. Original game story written by the Batman comic and writer Scott Peterson and Kenji Terrar of Final Fantasy fame. Based on the Batman comic book. Wow, way to be descriptive. Like, ground, I'll, I'll get ready for this. Uh, groundbreaking stealth game animation. An intellectually stimulating detective element, state of the art graphics, and breathtaking cinematic sequences. Like, they're really trying to make, sell this game. They're trying to make it sound better than it actually is. That's what they're trying to do. Never done before, like. But come on, these are just some. These are just buzzwords. That's all they are. Funny thing is, this game was supposed to come- this game was announced in like 2001 as like a GameCube exclusive, but then for some reason, like, it took like two years to make this game. It got delayed. That's why you had like Batman Vengeance come out before this, because then they released this on the Xbox. The PS2, that got cancelled, because why would anyone buy that? <laughs> And not to mention, 2003 was not a good year for TC. I mean, you had this and Aquaman Battle for Atlantis. That is a game I'm trying to find and I want to play so bad because it's so bad. But I can't find it anywhere and it's kind of irritating. I mean, is it that rare of a game? Or did they not make enough copies of it? I don't know. Alright. Hope you enjoyed that long cutscene. Bat cups can be used to restrain enemies. Cup them quickly so they won't attack you again. And you still can't see anything. This is the brightest I can put the game and you still can't see anything. How do I use this? Why do I need this? All of that. How do you cuff them? I don't think it, told, it tells you. That's a problem. Uh, I'm looking through this. Okay, X. That lip. <laughs> What are you doing? Oh. Also, the camera, you can't control the camera, so... That's a problem. It's trying to be like all cinematic, but it just doesn't work. If you can't see anything... Did it. Look at that. And then poof. Next scene. Barbara, she's sounding a bit older than usual. I mean, anytime I've seen Oracle, she's like pretty young-ish. But she sounds like she's in her mid-50s. <laughs> Which, I don't know why they made that decision. So I head to the roof of Gotham Police Headquarters. Use back cable to swing and the back rubble to move up and down. Okay, so you know the Arkham games. One of the best parts about that game is that when you use the grappling hook, you're swinging around all over the place. It is fun. It gets places so quick. No, it's great. 
This game doesn't have that. Oh no, you're about to see how it works. And also, yeah, there's no camera control. It's a cinematic camera. I'm look at me. Look, look, look. I'm using the C stick. This is what usually, you know, how the camera works in most games. Nothing. N n nothing. So, you have no control of this camera. And that's not good. <laughs> that kick. That kick is so weak. I forgot. How do you change? Oh. Back raffle. Why am I at? What's wrong with me? Why am I? Why, why am I so slow? Did I press a button? Oh, that's how you do it. Uh, look at me. Where is that thing even going? I don't even know where it's going to. It's like Spider-Man. You don't know where his web is. Look at me. I'm just hanging around, being a Batman. I, oh, I barely survived that. Because apparently you just can't jump forward for some reason. Oh my god. I can't. Now are you seeing why I didn't want to play this game before? I don't, I don't think it matters. Let's try this again. So we gotta be up there. I know that. Up in his X. It's just up there. This is so sad. This is embarrassing. And then you just jump. Oh wow, I did it! Amazing! If I die, I, I would have been pissed. If I, that's how I would die. Alright. B is jump. So let's do this. Ascend. Like, doing this is so slow. Like, oh my god. It's so tedious. And you have to time yourself just right. And I still don't know where that grappling hook's connecting to. It's just connecting to thin air. So, I have to, so the strategy is you gotta go all the way up. And jump. Press X, and then ascend, and that's it. That's how you do it. I don't know why he has to do these unnecessary flips, but yeah, uh, that's what you do. And it takes so long to climb a ladder. Oh no. <laughs> Dang it. How was I supposed to this the camera is your worst enemy in this game. Cause you can't see what's ahead of you sometimes because of this camera. Reminds me of Catwoman, uh that game where the camera doesn't move. Or it moves for you and you have no control over it, which means it's gonna be real easy for you to die. Which really pisses me off. Okay. Alright, did it. Let's keep going. I could get past three buildings, then I'll call it a day. It'll be. No. We'll go a bit further than that, but. At least I'll be a bit farther than where I was. No. Go up. Go up, go up, keep going. Dang it. This is a problem. X. So you gotta press X. So you have to press. Well, yeah, you need to jump and then press X as fast as possible if you wanna do this right. So you just have to like jam on the X button in order to not fall to your death. 
did it. All right, climb up this ladder again. It's this part right here. Like the game doesn't really tell you, hey, uh, like if I could like see, I'd be like, oh, maybe there's something back there. But last time I didn't, and I died. Oh my god, I couldn't even jump. I don't think the game even allowed me to jump. Well, oh, come on, I'm right there. Just... Okay, good. I didn't die. Progress, everybody. <laughs> wow, I actually got somewhere. Oh, come on. Ugh. I keep forgetting that most of the time it's like A is jump, but here it's B. I'm trying to get in front of this ladder, but it's not. <laughs> Why? Okay, we're getting somewhere. Oh my gosh, the camera. Camera, you're not helping me out. No! Ooh. God, I got those reflexes. I barely survived that. It's so slow. No! Oh my god. No, not again. I'm never gonna get past this first level. <laughs> Better be a checkpoint. Okay, good. Come on, jump. You've done it before. You did it before. Jump here. Climb. Okay. Jump here. Ooh, that was cool. Here. This is the game's just like, nah, son, I'm gonna screw you over. There we go. Alright. Guys, again. Hopefully this doesn't break. If it does, I'm gonna be upset. Okay. Woo! Oh my god, it just keeps going! How many buildings do I have to cross? Uh, this camera is not helping me at all. Alright. Alright, we're, we're getting somewhere. Hopefully we're getting closer. And I can't even jump over this thing for some reason. Oh, my. Oh, no. Come on. Like, really? Jump again. <sighs> Swear. Like, I'm trying to jump over this, but it's not working. You know, you think I would be able to jump over this, but no. This game must be challenging. You gotta jump over that, because of course, that makes sense. You can't even jump that far, so. Like, why? This, this is awful. How did they release this? I, I really want to know, how did they release this game? This game should have been cancelled while it was ahead. That way, you know, you could have saved yourself a bit of money. But no, you said, well, let's release this. People will buy it, and then guess what? No one did, because the game was so bad that no one wanted to give it a chance. Oh, no. Oh, my. We're going to be stuck here forever, ladies and gentlemen. Hope you enjoyed So we're at the third part of this. We gotta jump here. Oh my god. Jump. Also, the sound effects are just, for Batman, are just weird. It's like he barely talks at all. Odd.
Yeah, you think I'd be able to just grab that, right? But I can't. This game's really stupid. And I die. There I go. <sighs> I will get through this part. At least this part. So I'm close enough. Okay, I'm getting closer. Hopefully. But the game's not telling me how far I need to go. So, this is telling me... This is giving me like a red thing. That's like, hey, go here. Trying to jump on this, but it's not working. Oh, there's that double jump. It doesn't really work all that well. Look at this. Look at his hand. It's like, I'm trying to jump. How can I not jump here? Like, this, that seems like the easiest jump imaginable. Oh, but I can jump here. Makes perfect sense. All right, I need to get a head start. Let's go. All right, just ascend, ascend. X. X. I don't think I'm going anywhere. That's a problem. X, again. I'm getting close to the building. Alright, it should take at least one more jump. And I'll get there. This is literally right there. If I die here, then I'm just done with everything. Okay. Oh. All right, where do I go from here? I mean, I could just go that way. I mean, that seems like the easiest way. Well, I'm defying physics. So <laughs> I was just like in the air, just walking on air for a second until the game realized, oh wait, you have to be on the ground. Just jump over this. Dang it. Ooh. I can't even see myself anymore. What the heck? Okay. Ooh. We're getting somewhere. Don't. Oh, these controls are terrible. These controls are the worst. All right. All right. Just gotta climb up on this. Double jump. Nailed it. Okay. Oh my God, we actually got somewhere. Amazing. Must you do that every time? What's wrong? We have reports of a massive shootout at Gazette Square. The reports also say that the gunmen are wearing elaborate masks. Black mask with gang of false faces. And that they're fighting against a lunatic holding a wooden dummy. Scarface and the ventriloquist. Another tier four. I'm afraid it's worse than that. Somehow these clowns got a hold of some pretty high-tech weaponry. Military-grade stuff. Understood. I'm on it. registered on all of my sensors. Watch out for structural damage, the same as the older buildings. Anything else? Yeah, it looks like Black Mask has gotten the upper hand and has taken control of the surrounding area. Keep me updated. Back that out. Have fun. Oh my god, I completed a level. Oh no, 
we're doing this again. Oh no, I was not prepared for this. I don't know what to do anymore. I don't know how to fight. I'm a terrible Batman. How do I fight? Oh, I figured it out. Why am I doing that? Oh, okay. You just used the R button. Well, I'm near death. Off to a great start. Oh, what do I do? Oh, what the? That's how the Batman dies. Why you gotta be so dramatic like that? Game over. I don't know why it uses like the Resident Evil game over screen. You notice that? It literally looks like. Don't I have any armor or anything? Just kick him to death. That's one. Keep kicking him. Why am I using that? There's no reason. Why am I? Oh. This guy's just stupid, or maybe I'm stupid, or we're both equally stupid. Dang. Okay. Now my wife. Gotta handcuff this guy, make sure he doesn't get up again. And handcuff you too. Did it. I don't know why it's all glowing like that. Oh, wow. This camera. I don't even know what's happening anymore. It's just... Uh. You know, you think DC... Would, uh, spattering. Alright, that's useful. You think DC would learn from their mistakes with, like, Superman 64 and stop releasing bad games? But you'd be wrong. Because they made this a mere four years later. And then Aquaman and Catwoman, and then Batman Begins wasn't too bad, but it wasn't great either. And then it wasn't until, like, 2009 when they released Batman Arkham Asylum that they realized, hey, we can put out decent games. And now, like, everyone knows the Arkham series. I mean, sure, what is it? Uh, Arkham Origins wasn't too great. Arkham Knight didn't have the best ending. But there's still good games. Way better than this. Handcuff them. I love the music just stopped. That was great. I don't even know where I'm going anymore. Gotta go this way. Nope. This way, I guess. Can I open the door? Oh, kick open the door. Come on, Batman. I thought you were better than this. Apparently not. Where do I go? This is not what I wanted to do. Cry. There has to be another way. Do I have to interrogate somebody? Game, you're not helping me out here. Oh. Something's glowing, but I'm not sure what. I know there was like a thing right there, but not being very specific. Okay, I'm lost. I'm confused. I don't know what to do anymore. I'm just gonna throw it at this guy. Oh, I can't even do that. Weak.
that this game's not telling me, hey, what's the objective? Yeah, you see that? That I think I don't know if you can see it all that well, but it's blinking for some reason, and I don't know why. It's really pissing me off. Trying to open this door. Oh. <laughs> well, the game didn't tell me this. It's like press A to open doors. They didn't want to tell me for some reason. Ooh. That was weak. I am dead. I I blew up too. Really? Just did like the flare flop? All right, I'm done. And his face is in a plank, wooden plank. Perfect. I'm done. I didn't know. I didn't mean to press continue. Dang it. Whatever. We were, okay, you know what, I'll play a little, tiny bit more. Try to get a bit further into this. Dang it, with these explosions. What the heck? This is overkill. Um. Got a problem. I'm dead. Beautiful. They just went full. They just went ballistic on me, and I'm dead. All right. Enough of that. I'm never playing this again. Period. Period. Point blank. Never. I don't know what I'll do next, but just have to wait and see. Make sure to subscribe, like this video, leave a comment, and uh, see you next time. Bye. And yeah, we're never playing this again.